everywhere I turn, I hear people saying, Yeah, it's summer! Yeah, let's sweat our balls off! Yeah, let's get really burned! Yeah, fuck yeah! Woohoo! Summertime! Yeah! Ugh, ugh, ugh. I wish I shared your enthusiasm. You see, vampires, we don't like the summer. Shocker! But we are pros at keeping cool. Us southern vampires, oh, we love our big hat, heaven say, folding fan, good lord, and our parasol. Mercy me. We also love to cool off from the inside out by consuming foods that are cooling. Like cucumbers, citrus, leafy greens, radishes, and my favorite, watermelon, because it looks like blah. Also, it is a fallacy that warm beverages make you hot. I know, crazy, but coffee will. So the next time this happens, oh my god, I don't understand why I'm so hot. It must be this hot beverage. <laughs> no. Wise up and have some mint tea instead, because mint, it's a cooling herb, and the warm water, it triggers the cooling function in your body. I know, it's genius. Yahtzee! A no-brainer way to stay cool is something I call Freedom titties. Come on, ladies, why would you hot box your boobs in the summer? Makes absolutely no sense. So let them out. They'll thank you as well as all these strangers passing by. Puberty's coming, I promise. Most importantly, know your pulse points so you can quickly clear yourself off with just a wet bandana and some peppermint oil. They're here, 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 and here. Woo! That's minty. Ah, oh, don't forget to do your neck. Cools you off so well, but also covers up bite marks and hickeys. So the next time you're sweating like a cat in a Korean deli, make a run for a lady. Think like a vampire. Eee.